Hi, this is Zach Mir from Zach's Traders Cafe with a look at uh, my trade of the day, which is uh, to buy euro sterling on any weakness towards 89 pence. That's been the support over the last couple of days. Uh, we hit uh, to 90 pence plus uh, on the announcement of the Trump victory, We've fallen back since there, but I would still suggest that uh, any dips towards the 89 uh, pence area are buying opportunities as the overall uptrend continues. And uh, our trade of the day, tip TV trade of the day, is to buy dips in the FTSE 100 to 67.45. I think we're at 68.30 at the moment. Uh, so uh, any dips uh, down to that area regarded as buying opportunities, regard uh, the objective is 68.20 to 69.00 and stop losses below 66.80. All right, I just want to mention uh, uh, dollar yen quickly and then uh, gold. Um, <laughs> we were there. Dollar yen. All right, dollar yen. What we got all the way down to 101. Um, let's have a look. The overnight low was 101.19. Um, I actually woke up at you know, 3 o'clock and I saw this. Uh, this was, you know, where was it at 3 o'clock? It was down at, um, it was it was at 103 something. And I and I, I thought it looked cheap there. Well, it got a lot cheaper, but now it's right again. Um, 103.80, I would be watching as resistance. If we can get back above there, I think we'll retest 105.50. Um, and yeah, we're, we're seeing signs of um, buyers returning again in that one. So, would that be your trade of the day? I, I don't. Um, oh, goodness me! What buy a break above one hundred three eighty? Let's see if we can actually achieve that. Yeah, why not? Go on then.